So the Pretty Polly is next. And this is for one of the three-year-old fillies that are maybe not quite fast enough for the guineas and need that a little bit further. It's over a mile and a quarter. And at the top we've got Chicane for Paul Rhodes. Hope Swell for Dan Hughes. Mystery of the Baltic Leon Van Rensburg Rivera for Paul Rhodes. Shimna Camellia for Dan Hughes. Society Sphere, CDJ Liggett. Swartz Corner, Darren Thompson and Sweet Tooth, Joshua Sutherland. Eight of them then in this, probably headed for the Oaks, most of these. And away they go, a little bit slow out was Joshua Sutherland's Sweet Tooth, but he's made up for all that tardy start. And it's Hope Swell, who is now disputing the lead with that slow start in Sweet Tooth. So no ground loss really at the beginning for Joshua Sutherland's Philly, and she's now just about a head in front of the blue jacketed Hope Swell, but that one obviously wants to lead. And the jockey's pushed it along into a commanding lead now of a good two lengths. Sweet Tooth seems quite happy to settle back into third with Mistress of the Baltic going off on her inside into second. The rest of them are virtually in a line, with probably just Chicane showing forth. The one closest to us is Rivera, but it's Hope Swell. Who's in the lead from Mystery of the Baltic and Sweet Tooth. And the rest of the field still running pretty much in a straight line. Shimna Camellia is probably just a back marker, but it's Hope Swell in the lead, so Dan Hughes might be top and tail in the field at the moment. Mystery of the Baltic is about four lengths down in second place with Sweet Tooth on that one's outside in third. Then comes Chicane and Rivera. Swartz Corners after that one and Society's Fear. And Shimna Camellia and just about the back marker in now, but Hope Swell leads. They've still got the best part of four furlongs to go, and Sweet Tooth is coming through to challenge in second. Mystery of the Baltic is third. Then comes Chicane after that one. Rivera still running around up the centre of the track. The grey Schwartz corner is now just the back marker as Shimna Camellia is making a bit of move up, a bit of a move up the inside. Society Sphere also trying to get going, but Hope Swell is still two to three clear passing the two pole from Sweet Tooth and Mystery of the Baltic are having a ding dong battle for second. Behind them, Chicane is starting to make steady progress. Then the rest of them are in a bit of a line. After that, Hope Swell passed the floor along pole, clearing the lead. Yes, she got enough to keep her going up the hill to the line. It's Hope Swell in the lead. They're beginning to close now. It's Chicane going up on the outside. Looks the biggest danger, but Hope Swell still in the lead. And Hope Swell looks like she's going to hang on and take it. Hope Swell just from Chicane. And Mistress of the Baltic and then Sweet Tooth and Rivera. And Hope Swell. They have won that race right at the start. We're taking the initiative. Oh, looks like there's a few stayers in there rather than speedsters. And hopes well. Dan Hughes will be hoping he's got himself another Oaks winner. He had one a couple of seasons ago. But Hopeswell takes it for Dan Hughes. She came for Paul Rhodes with second. Mistress of, the, Mistress of the Baltic, Leon Van Rensburg third. Sweet Tooth, Joshua Sutherland fourth. And Rivera for Paul Rhodes was fifth.